Hmm. Interesting. Uh, hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Hardcore Survival. If you remember what happened last time, you are doing better than me. If you didn't, well then, eh. I actually don't remember what we did last time. Oh. 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 I forgot Minecraft does that. Oh. Oh. Why? Why do you torture me? Oh, I mean, like, it's it's just a texture overpack, right? I hate it still. I hate it. I still need to kill some of these guys. As bad as it is, I need to kill a few of those innocent animals. We also have to deal with this. You know. What do you do? What do you do? Right? <laughs> this actually does make me wonder. What do I do? Uh... Still got stuff. I should probably put my armor on. Yeah, yeah, that would be uh, relatively intelligent. <clears throat> I'm a bit tired. I'm a bit sleepy, but I'm also not as sleepy as I was, as I would expect. I must say, this room is really nice. Very nice room I built for that zombie. Nice little chamber. He's looking at somber, beautiful colors. Okay, what do you got? You got unbreaking three. We got sharpness five, mending, and respiration three. I guess our next stop is efficiency five, or something along those lines. I need to get a minecart. Welcome, Jews! Welcome to our party! And you see just how, uh, funkdiggly dancious. Yeah, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! How's it going for you this season? I guess it would be, what, three in the morning for you? Yeah. Oh, you don't. You don't even get to open your gifts yet. Ha <laughs> ha! Loser. What am I looking for? I'm looking for minecarts. There we go. Loser! You don't even get to open your Christmas gifts. Where's all my lecterns, actually? Huh. Where all my lecterns go? <laughs> I need those. Hello! Welcome! Welcome to the party! Hopefully your Christmas is going nicely. Hopefully it's going smoothly. I might have left the lecterns back over here like an absolute buffoon. Buffoonery! Cold pasta? Why would I eat cold pasta? I mean, like, I just ate a turkey dinner, like, literally five minutes ago, so... Definitely ain't eating cold pasta. You know, I'm pretty sure you probably noticed, but I think you might have caps on. That's a lot of shouting you're doing. Like, we like to use our inside voice, since we're inside. Oh, nice! Always fun, always fun. I'm very sober and playing Minecraft, so it evens out. Actually, no, I don't think that evens out in the slightest, does it? It just makes it even sadder. Where did my lecterns go? Oh my goodness. Did I leave them in the potion room? I need lecterns to do stuff. True, true. My liver would definitely be praising me for my self-restraint. <laughs> my uh, insulin reserves would probably say that I'm a complete monster, though. The amount of sugar I eat on a daily basis is way too high.
Uh, Pepsi. I drink a lot of Pepsi. Way too much Pepsi. Like, I would not be surprised if I was diagnosed with diabetes, but apparently my health is still just too good. I'm still just too perfect. Where'd the hackity hack and hacks? Yeah, regular Pepsi. Where? Did I leave it? Oh my. I had at least 23 lecterns, okay? I should have 23 lecterns somewhere. And I need those lecterns to do my thing. Because I can't do things without lecterns. Get the issue? I hope so. I was not a fan. Where did the heckin' lecterns go? Oh my gosh, there, darling. I don't even know where they've gone. I don't even know where to begin where they've gone. Not even a chest for them to go to. That's got snowbirds. This doesn't even have a chest up here. That's a lectern, but it's not. Like, this is such a confusing situation. I mean, like, I guess... I guess I could make more lecterns. I really don't want to, but I could. Okay, yeah, I will. Looks like I'll be creating deforestation, but still. I wouldn't really call myself a fossil. You know? I think dinosaur is cool, but fossils are kind of weird. Uh, bone meal, bone meal, bone meal. I don't think there's any reason to have bone meal except for trees now. At this point. Break up like a helmet, you did. You're right there. I've never lost a fight against Mike Tyson. You look at that. Logic works when you ask it to. Did I just. Did I? Well, that sounds appropriate. That sounds like a very appropriate thing to say. I don't need this, but I will... I will take these. Okay, time to decimate a forest ecosystem. Okay. I have been reading a book recently. I've been binging it so much. And... <clears throat> I have to say, it's a good book. It's a good book, don't get me wrong. But it, maybe I'm just jubilee, jubilee full of, you know, joy and stuff like that because the book takes place in a place that's not South Korea. Like, don't get me wrong, South Korea is cool and all, but, you know, there's only so many times you can listen to stories about South Korea before it just starts to get like, Ooh, please stop. Because that's usually the setting for a lot of the styles of books, you know, the ideas where it's like, uh, something happens and all of a sudden the entire... Okay. And all of a sudden, you know, it seems the entire world is now in some kind of calamity situation. But now, we follow a South Korean protagonist who apparently has the power to save the world. 
Oh, nice. That's got to be fun. I don't have to pretend. I just like reading books. And you know, those kind of books are pretty cool, I guess. It doesn't want to do that. Just super annoying. Because there's only so much you can read about South Korea before it's like, please. And the great thing is that the character isn't uh, even New York. Mr. Totally Not Tired. I mean, Jack Daniels is definitely a suitable name. More like alcohol, but still. But yeah, no, Jack works. Jack Smith. It's weird to think that some last names just come from pr professions. Like, you know, John Smith would be an actual... He, they would have been the son of a blacksmith. You know? John Smith II would have been, like, named after another John Smith. It's it's very weird, you know. Uh, there's her headphone jack. I wonder if Taylor also falls under that situation, as opposed to being... Because I don't think I've ever heard of Taylor being a last name, though. That's more of a first name... Jack Septicai? I'll be the new Jack. I promise I won't be as funny, but I'll be the new Jack Septicai. Jack Rabbits are weird. Uh, what was I thinking about? I was thinking about something. Uh, I don't remember what I was thinking about. So in this situation, I think I'm going to have to take down a ocean monument. That's what I think I'm going to have to do today. Just to feel proud with myself. I also need to finish the hourglass and make a uh, what's it called? A fish tank. That one's, that one's just bad. That one's just bad. I'm not even going to give you props for that one. you waste so much of my precious seedlings. You know, actually that, that right there reminds me of something. You know, it, it doesn't make sense that Santa Claus gives people coal if they're naughty. You know, because back in the era when Santa Claus was around, coal would be a vital, life-saving, you know, resource. You could, you could run your fire for a couple hours to warm up from the cold winter nights, you know? That's not a bad gift. That's a good gift. That's a great gift. <clears throat> sure, it's not a, you know, a toy or, you know, anything like that, but a life-saving gift is much better than a toy in my opinion. And judging from what I know of people, my opinion is very out of the, uh, Outside of the box, Jack in the box. Uh, but still. So I thought about it, and I'm like, no. It would be a little less, like, where do elves come from? We're told that they're magical creatures, but what if they're just kidnapped, naughty children? You know? They're half the size of a regular man, so they're pretty much the size of a child. You know? What does he do with the naughty kids? He gives them coal? Yeah, right. <clears throat> you see, kids don't care about coal, about fire nowadays. But then again, 
that's a difference in uh, era, really. But I thought about it, and it's like, huh. It would make a lot more sense if the quote-unquote immortal elves were actually just kidnapped children that were put on the naughty list. You know? It would, it would kind of put him in line with being like Krampus, who is like the anti-Santa Claus who kidnaps and tortures bad children. But it's like, huh, it makes sense. Because how else are you going to teach them, you know? Kidnap them for a full year, make them make toys for the rest of the world, and then bring them back to their parents. Or hell, if they're super bad children, just keep them for the rest of their existence. Like, I thought, I think that would make a make more sense situation. Granted, you know, Santa Claus in and of himself doesn't make sense, but still. I also like burning down orphans. Oh, orphan snowman. Okay, whoopsie. I like burning orphans. Are they gonna cry to their parents? <laughs> you know, I always forget just how, uh, like that I am. Isn't that a cool and unique situation for you to have seen? I like burning their... I like burning orphan orphanages when their parents aren't home. <laughs> That's basically any time all the time. If you catch my drift there, darling. Oh, you sweet darling, I can't believe ya. Oh, did you say hi to your brother for me? I want to say hi. Oh, you've grown so big. Oh, you've so grown so big, you little sweet cheeks. Oh, I don't like that. I I was trying to channel my inner, uh, what is it, aunt, uncle? It's like, oh, you've grown so big! But it, it, it just doesn't work. It just doesn't work. Oh, how, how many years has it been since I... <laughs> How many years has it been since we've last seen each other and you've grown so big? Oh! Ho, ho. You know, it's one of those types of situations. I'm clearly not good at it, but you know. How dare you? Get out of my house! Time for the wine and book club! Uh, because they're nothing but petroleum. You know what's weird to think? Oil can never again be produced on Earth. Unless there's a mass extinction of a specific type of bacteria, you will never see oil again on Earth. Like, that's a weird thought, isn't it? Because oil was produced from, I guess you could say, the breakdown of, uh, of, uh, or is it oil or is it fossils? It's, it's fossils, sorry, not oil. Is it? It's one of the two. I don't quite remember which. Clearly, I'm, uh, not too learned on myself. Yeah. But yeah, no, it's uh, it's one of those two. It's either oil or fossils, and it's because of bacteria evolved, which decays. Well, if it's decay, if it, if it's decay, I would assume that fossils can't be produced. Hmm. 
Well, dang, I guess you're a fossil to a fossil. You're a grand fossil. You're not a fossil, you're a square. But no, uh, what was I thinking about? Yes, it's either fossils or oil. No, because that's illegal. Knowing that you're underage. The cops would get involved, because I would call them to make sure they're involved. I'm a petty little bastard. Okay, we got... Three, six, about seven stacks of wood. That's looking good for me. I'll just finish up this last tree and we'll be done with collecting wood. I mean, that's a very unique mindset. Nothing's illegal if you don't get caught. But I must say, there's a lot of situations where, uh, that is very dangerous. You know, child trafficking, human trafficking, children, just having them in general, like, it should just be illegal. You know, we should go to China and be like, hey, one kid law, one kid law, you know? We'll, t we'll take a page out of China's book, one child laws. Then I wouldn't be born, but I'd be fine with that. What do you mean I'm lame? I'm the coolest bro in the world. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Pretty weird, but pretty cool. You know, weird flex, but okay. I need emeralds. I need books. I need wood. For these hoods. Okay, I've got emeralds, I've got books, I've got wood. I've got a stiffy. No, I don't. Okay, we just need one of those bastards. Nice. You. I knew it. Aha, loser. You have a bunch of bookshelves that you are going to let me break. For books so that I can extort you for more money than you made me pay. Because what, I get three books per bookshelf? Oh, nice! But, why would they blame me for your sleep deprivation? That sounds exclusively like a you problem. Like, I already stream three to four times a week, you know? Even I need to... Even I need to have a healthy sleep schedule. Even if it's not all that healthy, but still. Glass! Books. Books. How dare you? Refresh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Losers. Losers all <laughs> oh. 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 Bunch of losers they are. I also need more bookshops, so <laughs> apparently that's gonna be important. Kinda of weird that lecterns sit inside the uh, redstone compartment. Uh, drink water. Or, you know, 
at least turn over when you vomit. At the very least, you should turn over when you vomit, so that you're not vomiting and just like keeping it there like a gargle. You know, like a spitting gargle. Is there a lectern there? Well, clearly you're speaking to us. It would be a very strange thing if you were. Give us a good job, sir! Quick charge. First of vanishing. Predator. And a little bit of food. Make sure that you have at least some bread in your stomach. Oh, you're dead, sir. Oh, wow. Well, good job. You're typing pretty fluently, at least I can tell. Spanish? Mexican? Is your first language in Mexican? It's not really a language, but you know. Polish. Never would have guessed. Polish. Interesting, that's actually pretty cool. Good job. Good job! I mean, I guess that's not really a good job type of thing, but good job! Walker is useless. Interesting. Cool. Hopefully your uh, meeting with them went well. Okay, we're gonna have to keep you. We're keeping you. <laughs> but you don't have efficiency 5. How dare you make me waste materials on you. move some of our things. We're gonna put the Trident's, the Trident Trio over here. What is it? Riptide Channeling and uh, Loyalty. We're gonna move the Trident Trio a little bit over here. There we go. That works for me. And we gotta wait for Chicky Pop down there to turn over and we'll be good. Loyalty. Loyalty levels, it goes up to level 3, good, and channeling only has one level, good. I still wonder where the rest of my- oh, I put it down in the- I know where it is. I know where it is now. I just waste, you know, a bunch of bookshelves doing nothing, but I know where my- I know where it is now. All of my lecterns that I had, yeah, they're down here. Wondering where everything was. Like, I should have had two minecarts, but I didn't. I must say, the cave below us, that big deep cave is heckin' scary. Like, it's just whoop, you know? Just whoop. Like, what do you do with that? It's scary. I don't like it. We'll put two minecarts back in there. They're technically supposed to be three blocks wide, but I've never gotten around to actually doing that, so... Yeah, we're, sit we're sitting at one block wide. But cool, it's a good thing that you like it. 
because it won't be changing anytime soon. Enough gravel, andesite. That. Uh. This, this, that. Wood. I need deep slate. I need. I got some deep slate, so I'm. I'm probably good for now. That's an interesting idea. I do deep slate. And I do that. Ooh. 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 I think I've made myself happy with knowledge that I am pretty much akin to a god in this world. I don't like copper. I don't I don't ever have a purpose for copper. Whoa. Whoa. You give me glass. And here's some you don't have books to sell. You give me glass. You don't have glass because you're a loser. You in the corner, give me glass. We'll let these puppies sleep for a moment whilst we go, uh. Whilst we let them recharge. Yeah, that's a good idea, me. Thank you, me. Oh, you're welcome, I so love you. Oh, you should do. I know it, me! Oh, that's a great idea that I had. Come on. Come on. I know, right? Like, look at this loser. He sells ink sacks for an emerald. I need glass! I need an emerald for 16 glass. Like, what the heck is... What the heck's up with that, you know? It's, it's bad, it's gross, no one likes it. What kind of loser buys ink sacks? Uh, voxel circle generator. Let me go there. Circle. I do not know how big the circle was last time, so that is a good question. Oh, yeah, darn dingle. Dinglers. Dingles all the way. Nice. So I gotta kill that one. Sorry. We're only killing a couple of them, okay? We're killing the bad- the ones with bad storage situations. Like, look at, look at this one, whoopsie, this one's got three, this one's got nine, so you know, they deserve it. This guy's on thin ice, because he's got six. He's on thin ice, and he knows it, he knows it. I mean, it was three llamas, it was four llamas. We still got four llamas. Okay, I need someone to give me a uh, helmet and chest piece. You, not you, you. Fast protection, I'm breaking. Protection, fire protection, I'm breaking. So let's go like this for a second. Go. Should be lava in that pot, but there's no lava in that pot. Big waste of uh. Ah, yeah, darn diddly! Why'd I click that button? Oh, yeah, darn diddler! How dare you diddle me like that? Oh, you darn diddler. It's okay for now. It's okay for now. We can do it. I just need a helmet. 
And for you to buy my iron, sir. I guess I'll take this for now. There we go. Oh, you look at that. We're looking fancier already. Oh, I need a pair of... Oh, I need a pair of boots. What's this one got? He's got fire protection on breaking. You've got fire protection on breaking. You're like the better version of him. I mean, <laughs> they're not really villagers anymore. They're more like pitmen. Hmm. I forgot that was there. That would've been bad. What are you doing, step bro? Um, <laughs> they live in a. You, you're right. You're right. They technically live inside a village. I was gonna say they live in more of a corporatocracy, but you're right. That's what I need to do. I need to count these voxels, lands. This thing go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. But I need sixteen, so I need to go. I need to go like this. Yes. 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 Perfect. Perfect. We are good to go. You know, if I could make them mine Bitcoin, that would be a very situ interesting situation. Okay. Hello, Slither. Welcome. Merry Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. How's it going for you? How's it How's it hanging? You enjoying your life so far? I get Christmas off, which is both good and horrible. Yes, Merry Christmas to you! Okay, let's go one, two, three. This is kind of trippy sitting up here like this. Uh, technically, Christmas isn't all that ready yet for me. I'm still, what, it's like 1 in the morning, 2 in the morning of Christmas Day, so we're still waiting on that. You slither, you get anything good for Christmas? Seven PM. Well, I guess that just indicates just how far apart our time zones are. Well, it's good that your time zone is more of a healthy situation. <laughs> In the future, yeah. Why didn't you warn us about nine eleven then, huh? I mean, like, I'm not American, so I don't have too much of a grudge on that, but, you know, you should have warned us, at least, you know. I, I had someone today. Oh. Yeah, I'm... Christmas on is uh, on the 25th of December for me. Uh, 
Uh, well, they, they celebrate Christmas Eve, right? It's usually the time that's meant to actually eat the Christmas dinner. You know, eat the food, you know, so that Christmas is all about the presents and gifts and, you know, the joy like that. You know, we, we celebrate the Eve of Christmas. As it could be put. It's, it's a very strange situation. It's kind of like, you know, Halloween, where it doesn't really translate too well, because it's technically not Halloween that we're supposed to celebrate. We're technically celebrating Old Hallow's Eve, which is meant to be... A situation where we're trying to ward off spirits as well as uh you know malicious spirits specifically i mean <laughs> yeah you're right right might makes right that's definitely a true statement for that Yeah, for Old Hallow's Eve, we're supposed to celebrate it by, you know, warding off evil spirits and stuff that could harm people. But now it's just for the candy. Whereas Christmas was meant to be a time that you then spend together with family and loved ones, and now it's just for the capitalistic gain of end presents. Oh cool, fishing rods! That's pretty cool. It's been a long time since I last went fishing. Hopefully, hopefully you're not a big one. Really sad. The state that a lot of holidays come to. But, you know can't you can't stop the march of time you just gotta keep running through it right right I need more glass people what happened to all my glass like seriously what happened to all my glass Well, it's a good thing. Yeah, that's true. I need to get more glass selling homies than that. So. Unfortunately, I gotta go deal with stuff. Welcome back, Choose. How's it going, Choosin? Susan. Ugh. Don't know what it is with Susan, it's just not a good name for me. Don't think I like it. Your dad dang three bottles of alcohol? That's expensive. Depending on how expensive the alcohol was. I'm very stingy on Christmas. Like, I'm pretty open to giving gifts, but I'm stingy as fuck. You didn't keep your class! Oh my god. Oh, oh, sir. Oh, son, you're going to die. Oh, son. Okay. I'm going to have to kill you. I'm gonna have to kill myself. This is my own fault. Oh my, oh my gosh. This is my own darn fault. I need to get more books. I need to get more emeralds. I forgot to trade with him to make sure he kept his class. So now I've got to do the stupid... Over here. Oh, 
Oh, dang. That sucks. I mean, it's what, eight days, nine days from now? So, you should be able to survive. You know, turkey leftovers and all that stuff. Oh, I need to get you a good book again. No, if you give me Sharpness 5, I'll be good. I really kind of want Riptide again, but I'll take Sharpness 5. Looting. Nice. That takes a lot of effort to get to that age. Quick charge. Gross. Efficiency 1. Gross. Nothing. Gross. I mean, you could eat Asian. You know, I said I would take it, so I'm gonna take it. Sharpness 5 it is. get a second one up here so I can start rotating them. Rotating the little bastards. Yeah, it's a lot of children. There's a lot of innocent children here. Quick charge. Press. I'm so sorry. I know it was my own fault that you died like that, but I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. I mean, at this point, it's truer than not. Knockback. Knockback 2 is not bad. But it could. It does get a little annoying if you're trying to keep them close and you start knocking them away. It does get a little annoying. Loyalty 2? If I'm gonna take you, I need loyalty 3, my guy. No, but did you know that you're more likely to cut yourself with a dull knife than you are with a sharp knife? I mean, I've cut myself with paper, but I've never really cut myself with a knife. just going to come home with Papa, aren't you? Oh, yes, you are. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, you're a good boy. Efficiency 5. Oh, you're a good boy. Oh. Oh, he's a good boy. He's going to come home with Daddy. He's going to come home with Daddy. No, I, sh I, I, I should never do that again. I hated that just as much as all of you. You know, when you cut yourself multiple times, that becomes an issue. You should talk to professional help about that. Yeah, you could get thimbles. Thimbles are pretty cool. <gasps> well. 
Would you look at that? Books for days. I need books. I need emeralds. Emeralds, emeralds, emeralds! I need emeralds! That's the wrong axe. Yes, sir, it is. That's the wrong axe, cause I'm gonna do the thing. Now I'm curious as to what it is. Oh, I've never seen that before either. That's a... That's a weird thing. I don't like that. I mean, also... Yeah, that's, that's just a weird thing. A finger guard? Ew, finger guard. I mean, like... You could just protect your fingers by cutting them with the by cutting with the proper technique. But of course, the, it doesn't matter what technique you use if you're using a dull knife. That's why you need to make sure your knives are nice and sharp. Also, I can't imagine how painful uh, cutting yourself with a dull knife with an while well, you're cutting onions would be. Like cutting yourself with a dull knife is one thing. Onions on top of that? Ugh. Ugh. Okay, so I think it's a wood and a diamond. And let's go here. Let's go. Jukebox. Do we want disc 13 or do we want a uh, cat? Which one do we want? We got one vote cat. Uh, no. That's a uh, disc uh, 11. We have two votes, cat. I'll give you a quick glimpse of 13. I will give you a quick glimpse in that after I... Okay, it is the spooky scary one. Merry Christmas! Welcome! Have a good thing! Enjoy your rest! Notice that this tracks the bottom of your head.
it's allowed. Interesting. Okay. That was enough of that. I wish I had take step two, but I don't. Even though I've conquered a bastion. Didn't get it. Didn't get pig step. You gimme You gimme glass. Okay, gimme emeralds. But I may buy glass. You gimme emeralds. But I may buy glass. Another one of those up there, that's weird. How's it doing, sir? It's going right for you. Up we go! I'm kind of surprised at how uh, undead. The people inside my uh, library are. Like, I was kind of expecting them to die. Yeah, I know. I mean, like, you can't really trust them to get to their location by themselves, really. That's about the main. That's about the main excuse of it. You just can't trust the darn. the darn, uh. villagers. Try and trick you and get away the moment they can. They know how to do it. They know how to do it. I need a second one. Be in my backhand for a little while. So we'll sleep for the evening. We'll just go. You know, we'll just we'll just do that, and then we'll look here. We'll see that we can't do anything with any of that trash, and we'll leave. Sounds appropriate. I need to make a bunch of pinch of pistons. That's not a good thing. Get out of my villager area, please. Creeper is not allowed. Even. I don't know why you have a sword, but cool. Uh. Oh, interesting. Seems a little weird in my opinion, but you know. Who am I to judge when I am me? Truthfully, who am I to judge? Well, it would be in my best interest to judge you. As that is my entire purpose in life, to judge others. I don't think I could stand on myself. I'm very particular about my keyboards, and so something like that would probably get on my nerves. Water. Water. What are you doing, step bro? Do I have any str 
string? That's a good question. If I'm gonna need string... Look at that. This is a great farm. is a very good farm design. Also these iron bars, despite being here for aesthetics, actually do serve a purpose and that is to protect the pumpkin and melon stems from being broken by the cascading tide of water that threatens to destroy them. You know, it's not like I'm doing things foolishly anymore. Does it look sicko mode? Can you go full Alexa play sicko mode? There's a lot of animals here. By a lot, I mean it's, it could be worse, but there's too many animals. The mob would putting it meanly be... Like putting it nicely is just a thinly veiled, hey yeah, they actually kind of suck. Then what is mean? that I have. I mean, I guess I could feed it to the cows, that would make sense. Trade it? Make bread? Mass murder? It's a unique description of an item. I don't know, I, I've I've kind of lowered my steam a little bit. We're, we're now cruising in the quiet, calm mode. I really gotta say, books really get you, really stimulate your, your thoughts. I ended up somehow thinking of a animation that I watched, like, what is it? I looked at the timeline, it was literally like eight years ago. It's like, holy shit, how did I even remember that? And with, it was about a League of Legends thing, when League of Legends was still brand new to the, to the world. It was really cool. They took voice clips from what the heroes say and then they made a song out of them. Really interesting. I like those kind of songs, where they take just regular voice clips and just edit it together to make it really cool. Nice! Oh, I'd even hope that you're doing things five times faster. 500% increased in efficiency.
Nice. Though that one might not be as nice for your body. Okay, we really need to start working on that wheat issue we got. We also need to turn or kill all of those guys on that side. It's about power, it's about bubble, loop it down, or diddly d, diddly d, d, d. Yeah, I've, I've heard that intro to the song, I think. Yeah, that. I just couldn't remember the uh, the words for some reason. Whee. Up you go. Welcome back to the next rotation of slavery. Where did all my golden apples go? That is a good question. Where did all my golden apples go? Couldn't have put them in the chest, could I? Gotta put them in a chest. not either of those. Maybe up here? Up here. I don't know what it is! But I pretty much have to crack my neck every single day. It's, it's very weird. Thanks for dropping by. Thanks for dropping by. It's been fun having you. Hopefully, uh, everything goes smoothly for you in the future. And a merry, happy Christmas to you. And thank you for that follow, Blanca. Uh, let's get emeralds, yeah. Use this to forcefully upgrade the rest of those rest of the innocents. We got 48 bookshelves, so we'll turn this into 48 times 3 books, which means how many books? Well, that is 48 times 3, so that should be like 100 books. Or something like that. I think 48 times 3, that's 128 times, that's 24, 144 books. That's how math works, right? Yeah, that should be how the math works. Math checks out, yeah. Okay. What is it, 36? 144. 144. I was just off. 
Fire protection, frost walker. Lots of frost walker today. Lots of frost walker. I think we'll let those guys sit for a little while, get themselves to uh, switch over to the new day, and we'll go put more glass down. That sounds like fun to me. We really haven't done anything worthwhile, men worth mentioning, have we? I mean, we traded some stuff, we cut down some trees, uh, we're making a giant hourglass into a fish tank. That's what I'm thinking of making right here. A giant hourglass that looks like a fish tank, or that will become a fish tank. And we also have to enchant some of our equipment so that we can go hunt down, uh things inside of the... I know this one. Ocean Monument. That's what it's called. This one should be a lot faster to make, judging from the fact that I know how to make it, because I'm just literally copying how to make it from looking down below. is just an hourglass after all. Mm. Nice, all the way done. Then you gotta go like this to make sure you get all the glass out of the area so you don't see those dreaded corners. Those dreaded corners look ugly. I'm gonna have to catch all the tropical fish in the area and maybe name them? That would be somewhat smart, wouldn't it? I named all the tropical fish? Maybe. Um, 
two, three, four, five, one, two, Maybe. Okay, it's just two. This, that, this. It would always suck if I messed up any of the uh, locations for anything. I think that I'm placing this on glass. Because imagine if I was doing this with obscurity, like with like a fully obscure obscure block or something like that, that would be... That would be awful, I can say. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six, yes, yeah, six. And it goes... One, two, three, four, five, six, good. Good, good, good. That means six is everywhere. Right there. Yeah, good. This, this, this. That, that, that. That, that, that. That, that, that. That's fine, that's fine. If I go like this, I should probably be able to do everything I need. Okay. First level is right there. And the second level... That'd be... What? First level would go like one, two. Or Yeah, that would be the first level. Goes three on each side, so one, two, three. Second level. I guess I only need to care about the last outside two. One. And 
one. Yeah. Hey, no worries. It's fun that you're still here. It's fun. <sighs> what games do you have on the pipeline, huh? What games do you have to choose from? This one all covered. Ah, uh, I don't really see anything that really interested me on the winter stream sale, unfortunately, so I wouldn't even know what's on there. And like it was clearly not enough to impress me, so I just kind of said no. Maybe I shouldn't have done it like that. Ubisoft? No, I'm not too familiar with them too much. I don't really like a lot of their games. Okay, let's see. We go... Corner here, all the way to here. Six, seven. Nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, and fifteen. Huh. See, there may be a slight Let's see. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, sixteen. And that's after looking at that, which is the center, so that would be frick line, but it should be like that, weirdly enough. It shouldn't be like this, it should be in the looks of it. because I was looking at the wrong level. One, two, seven, nine, ten, eleven, fourteen, fifteen, like that, sure. This, and that, and that, and that, and one, two. There we go. Any games you're specifically interested in? You know, any good things? I see where I went wrong. Okay. 
not picky. Well, then what's the point of being a gamer? I really want to lose all this glass, but I've got to break it all. Got to break it all. Mmm, makes sense. This is a darn shame. A waste of time and energy to do this. But that's okay, you know? We, we just kinda gotta keep on rolling. Make sure it looks good at the end. Better to break it now and feel sad than to break it later and be like, oh wow! even worse than I expected. At least you're like Minecraft, right? That's good at least. You know something you like. There's a lot of creepers in there. Okay, no worries. I'ma just stay here. Since 2018, holy snapperoonies. That's an old game. Never even thought that Rocket League would be that old. That's actually... Well, aren't you just the fanciest things in the world? I'm gonna have to catch you all later. So that's the thing, I'm gonna have to catch a bunch of these fish later. Guessed, you know, never would have guessed. Hmm. Definitely never would have guessed.
Okay, so let's see. We start here. Two, three, four, five. Let's look at. Make sure that this is all like this. up from one to two B. Not too bad. Yeah, I I know what it is. I just never thought it was that old. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That we get its own tab and we'll go. All right. And out. Like I'm a little bit further out than that one. Let's see. Let's count this again. We're in the corner. Oh, we're in the corner here. That would be that. Right? That would be nine. Okay. Drop nine. One, two, six. I'm not exactly in the form there. One this way. Or no, I guess we don't. This is. Let's see. If that's a two by two in the very center, two by two, and you put one layer around it. This goes one, two, three. I'm pretty sure. Interesting. We equate that. Where are we? Where are we on this? Okay. Corners are all covered. Corners 
cards are all cup that. Leaving us with a 4x4 four four spot. I go here and I go up one. We are here. I mean, yeah, we are here. Okay. Do this way. That one doesn't. Six, one, two. go finally Ugh. okay oh, okay that's that's better that's looking better Okay, if we go here, we'll look at this. Okay, this is pretty easy, honestly. It's not too hard. I, and I've still got the bad habit of trying to place my personal homebrewed characters into the stories I like to read. And I've been trying to stop it because, well, my characters don't usually fit into those stories actually. You know, Homicidal Maniac doesn't really fit into a very jubilee joyous story, you know? So I've been trying to cut it out, but it seems like they would actually fit into the story that I'm currently reading a lot, and it's like, huh. 
I wonder how much of a influence the story would have had on my character if I had read it before I made her. Before I made them. I would have to say my character's a little cringe. Granted, that cringe also kind of comes from me torturing them a lot, because I'm a sadistic fucker. Okay, so we these out on one of each of these. Three. And the only spot that changes are the other sides. Okay. Feels weird doing it upside down, but you know what? If it works, it works. That is the important part. Okay, then we go down, we completely skip that one. Now we can go like this and go... Four... Five... Six... Oopsies. Oopsies. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, okay. Pretty simple, pretty simple, yeah, pretty simple, yeah, I like it, pretty simple. Let's hope it remains simple. And we're out of glass, okay. Oh man, that could have killed me. That could have killed me. No lies about it. No if, ands, or buts. to kill me it would have killed me I am happy that like I'm pretty sure that would have normally killed me but because I have armor on it didn't that's very nice it's very nice would have been awful if it killed me honestly pretty awful I 
Okay, let's look at this. I need more glass! Glass! Yeah, I need more glass! Before that, let's check up on our secondary slave. Definitely got that turned up. Let's go get the book and potion, which should be inside one of my chests. So you can turn you once more. Honestly, I should be leaving these in the llamas, because that's where it's like almost always going to be close to. Now I went to the nether to get a bunch of gold, and I got a bunch of gold, but I've used up like 20 apples at this point, and it's ridiculous. Okay, let's get some obsidian actually. If we bring some obsidian with us, we can make a portal when we get there. Miscellaneous brick, bricks, obsidian four. That it? That seems to be it. I don't have any other obsidian. Huh. Huh. Interesting. I need to get a water bucket. I think I should have a rough idea as to where some lava is. We can go this way until we reach running, running water. There should be lava near there. No, we took away the running water at this right. Because I am smart. SMRT, smart. And we ran the wrong direction. I always think it's left, it's always right. I'm used to digging left first as opposed to digging right. Oh well, it's my own fault. I played GTFO the other day. The horror team-based game. It wasn't terrible. I mean, it was kind of boring. Controls were decent enough. The challenge was okay, but it was just kind of boring. Like, I don't even know what to say about it. to find the pathway into the cave system. It seem worthwhile that I brought a water bucket with me, doesn't it now? Five. There we go. 
You got 10, that's the minimum you need. Two, four, six, yeah. That's the minimum number you need to make a portal. So we're going to make a portal with that. Don't quite remember what Aqua Infinity does. And I think that is perfectly fine. Lots of Frostwalker, honestly. Way too much Frostwalker. Okay, that should be enough glass for now. I'm hoping. Because if it's not enough glass, then I might have to kill someone. That's a lot of glass. That's a lot of fucking glass. Okay, though, we'll get this done quickly enough. Okay, yeah. One, two, five, six. Six. Or, nope, wrong. That's one, two. Okay, got one more. This one we skipped the corners. Six. Make the funny side.
Okay. And I think that's the end of that one, so we go down. It's much easier to do when you know what you're doing. Hello, Feng Shei! Welcome! How's it going? How's how's your holiday? How was your Christmas break? That's good! You know, a lot of people could be envious. Six. Okay, it's me. Okay. There goes that. Two. One. One. That's good. At least it. At least it was good at the end. Were you able to spend the holidays with your family or were you stuck stuck in like a dorm or something? Clean up any gaps that were left. Okay, what am I looking at? I'm looking at You were stuck in the middle of taking exams and or tests and stuff like that. I assumed you were older. Well, that's fine either way. Uh, it hasn't happened yet. I mean, yeah, it technically hasn't happened yet. Christmas is. Nope, not yet. Currently, we are at in the morning on Christmas Day, so it really hasn't started. We've been... 
September because of the time difference in our two different in our areas. Okay, we're currently just fixing up our aquarium that we've decided to build. Making sure there's a... Uh, no worries, thanks for dropping by, it's fun having you. Hopefully everything goes well. Have a good rest of your day. And a merry holiday for you. Okay, not bad, not bad. A little bit of last minute touch ups, and this is pretty much done. this done smoothly. Gotta love it, gotta love it.
sure how many days it's been since I've rested. of a lot better than what it was looking at. so much it's almost an awful situation. This is one of the slower, more tedious processes. Luckily, the uh, next step should be faster. Okay. 
it's still a little annoying with all this water, but you know. A little annoying is a lot better than a lot annoying. So, what can you do? quiet now. You know, I kind of feel like a kid in a candy store. Especially now that I have a job and I have money. But I'm also, you know, used to my old habits of never spend money. Doing that is like a sin, you know? I don't like spending money at all. No, that's not true. I like spending money, but I only like spending money on others, almost. I don't like spending money on myself. anymore we're just blah we're just blah minecraft isn't a very ooh, ooh, ooh. yeah i forgot about the whole suffocation thing not really my kind of fetish you know some people might like it asphyxiation erotic you know all that good stuff really not my cup of tea are gone. It's always interesting reading more stories. I can get like, uh, what is it called? Drowned in here. But assume so. 
They are just water monsters, aren't they? The like phantoms will start appearing on this night. This is very annoying, I must say. I think that's good enough for now. Let's go uh, change our equipment and head out to kill the guardians, the other guardians in the area. That literally sunk my heart. Not a big fan of heights, I have to say. Not a big fan of heights. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of salsa. Salsarinos. You know, this could very well backfire and kill me. 
You know what? We're just not going to do that. We're going to hold off for a little while. As much as I want to go to the thing, I'm also wanting to be smart and not stupid and not waste any of all of the progress. Because we are on what? Day... Day 150, 150 days. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, I have to say. No? About half a year in Minecraft? That's pretty good. I like it. But you know what? That's pretty much all we got time for. That's really pretty much all we got time for. I mean, we've done so much. So, so much. We've dealt with those guys, we've dealt with those guys, we did some of that, some of our big baby in the distance, you know, we definitely makes a big difference when it's filled with water. It looks like a glass punch bowl as opposed to anything else, but eh, you know, we make do with what we can. So thank you so much everybody for coming and watching and joining us today. If you liked what you saw, have you checked something else mine? If you didn't, then oh well. Thank you so much. We have had fun. Thank you so much and have a great night.